How you doing? Uh, James Clark again from the Marine Inn at Grand Dunes here in Myrtle Beach, uh, Waterscapes Restaurant. Uh, I just wanted to do uh, a quick demonstration on how I clean uh, the lionfish. It's not how everybody does it, but this is the way I figured out. It's also the safest uh, way. First, what I like to do is go in and I clip all the fins off because this is where the ends of these fins is where the venom is. Now, some of these, from what I understand, some of these fins aren't all carrying the venom. I mean, these pectoral fins, I'm not sure if they have them in them, but I tell you, I'm not going to chance it. But I do know that this dorsal fin uh, is where this venom lies. And it sort of goes all the way down the body. And they almost look sort of like porcupine quills. quills. There's one left. Snip him off. Then I'm going to take the tail fin off just to be safe. And then I'm almost sure that this one underneath, on the bottom, which I'm not quite sure what the name of that fin is, but that one too comes off. And then the pectoral fins on the other side come off. Now, just because these fins have all been taken off doesn't mean that you're completely out of the woods. Still have to be extremely careful with this fish because if you look closely on his face, he has lots of little pricks and, and, uh, and sharp edges that are right here on the top that you really want to be careful with. And you can see how the little edges right here are still in there that you really, really, really want to be careful with. So I keep a towel in my hand and gently slice down and fillet it just like I would any other fish. Being very, very careful. But as you've seen in plenty of videos and pictures on the blog here um, of the scorpion fish, the meat and texture of the line fish is almost exactly the same as the scorpion fish. It's got a little bit of a cleaner, whiter color to it. There we go. Almost a little bit of cleaner, whiter color to it, but it has almost a very similar muscle structure uh, to the line fish also. And that's how we do it. So if you've got any questions uh, about lionfish, I'm not a professional, but I have been reading a lot about them. Uh, please feel free to email me or leave a comment here on the blog. Thank you.